The submental triangle is a region in the anterior triangle of the neck that sits just underneath the chin. It's a rather small area with little important contents, but even so it's worth having a good understanding of it. If you've not already watched my previous video giving an overview of the anterior triangle of the neck, I'd quickly take a look at that now, as it'll help contextualise this knowledge a little better. Come back to this video when you're done. The submental triangle is best viewed from an inferior perspective, as we see here. It's bounded inferiorly by the hyoid bone, laterally by the anterior belly of the digastric muscle, and medially by an imaginary line drawn down the midline of the neck. In the floor is the large mylohyoid muscle, which spans both the left and right submental triangles. There are usually around three small lymph nodes within the submental triangle, helpfully known as the submental nodes, which eventually drain into the deep lateral cervical nodes in the neck. We also have the terminal part of the submental arteries, which arise from the facial arteries, and the submental veins, which drain into the facial vein. Lastly, we have the anterior jugular vein, which originates up here in the submental triangle before coursing downwards to drain much of the anterior neck. And that's it. I told you there wasn't much to say about the submental triangle. If you're interested in the rest of the anatomy of the neck, I have videos covering every individual triangle in detail on my channel. So go there and check them out, and don't forget to subscribe. In the meantime, I hope you learned something, and have a great day.